Hi there, welcome back. Dan again from Clean Guru. So, how do we fix our cleaning business? Um, here's where to start. I was watching uh, uh, Nick Saban, the coach, the head coach of the University of Alabama football team, and I'm not a big Alabama football team fan. I'm, I'm an Ohio State Buckeye fan, and maybe also in a way a Michigan fan because I have some family up there too. But certainly not an Alabama fan. But Nick Saban was talking about his team, and they were trying to really get them ready for their year. And one of the big things is not just physically, but mentally, they have to be ready. And he was really pushing on the big point, where do you start? You start, you have to start with the truth. And he talked to these young guys about the fact that, you know, for all their lives maybe, they've been told they're so great, they're so wonderful. But when they hit that, that field to go out for their first few games, it won't matter the history of all this. It's going to matter, can they beat those guys? Do they have their, their mind right as far as the truth? And then work on their weaknesses to get better. Well, I thought it was a great point uh, because it's something we need to do if we want to, let's say, fix our cleaning business or fix anything, right? We have to start with the truth. It reminds me of when we try to lose weight and maybe we're heavy and you'll often see pictures of people who want to start that process and maybe they feel very heavy but they take a picture or pictures of themselves they also weigh themselves because the scale doesn't lie right they want to start with the truth if they don't start there then all the solutions they come up with may not be the right solution because they weren't based on the facts of what really is the case and that's what coach Saban was trying to say too same thing in our cleaning company. We have to start with the truth. Well, what sometimes can be the ugly truth? Well, it might be that we're not doing some things we should be doing. If you compare yourself to, let's say, a, a cleaning business you really admire, well, if you look under the hood and you find out what that cleaning business is really doing, they may be doing a lot more training than we were, than we are. They may be doing more a screening than we are. They may be doing more Oh, motivation and communication. They may be doing lots of things. They may be inspecting more. They may be doing a lot of things that the truth is we're not doing. They may be making more calls, uh, making more uh, social media push to try to promote their company. If, though, we can start with the truth, then we can fix nearly any problem in our cleaning business. That's the truth, too. Until next time, remember, you can do this. You really can.